I am Anil Kumar and in this video we are going to explore how to find quadratic equation from the given scatter plot. So we will do modeling using vertex form of the quadratic equation. So let me first write down what the vertex form is. In vertex form quadratic equation could be written as y equals to a times x minus p whole square plus q where p cube is the vertex. The question here is, determine an equation to describe the curve that best fits the given scatter plot. So we're given few points here. If we connect these points, we observe that it forms a parabola, right? So I'm just connecting it. It is kind of a parabola, right? In this parabola, you can see clearly that the vertex is at x equals to 2. So what we observe here is that vertex is at x equals to 2 and the y value is 80, right? So y equals to 80 or the coordinate points could be written as 280, correct? Now if we use this vertex, then we can write the general form as y equals to a times x minus 2 whole square plus 80. Now the question is how to find the value of a? To find the value of a we could use any of the given points. However, the best point is the y-intercept itself. So we know y-intercept is given to us as 0, 60. So at x equals to 0, y is 60. So if I substitute this value, we can actually calculate equation of this parabola. So y is 60, we will write this as 60 equals to a times, we are substituting this value here in this equation, a times x is 0, right? So 0 minus 2 whole square plus 80. So that gives us 60 equals to 2 square is 4, 4a four plus 80 or 60 minus 80 equals to 4a that is 20 with a negative sign equals to 4a and that gives us the value of a as minus 20 over 4 or minus 5 correct so if a is minus 5 i can substitute this value of a in the general form of the equation and rewrite the equation as y equals to minus 5 x minus 2 whole square plus 80. So that becomes the equation in vertex form. So that is the equation in vertex form. So that's what we wanted to do. So we have a scatter plot here. We utilize the vertex and the y-intercept to write equation first in general form using the vertex which is at 280 and then to find the value of a we use the y-intercept and found the value of a as minus 5 giving us the answer as y equals to minus 5 x minus 2 whole square plus 80. Now what you could do here is you could rewrite the equation in standard form. So, so the question for you is write this equation in standard form. Okay. All right. So you need to expand this and then combine the like terms to get the equation in standard form. So that could be an added exercise for you. I hope that helps. I'm Anil Kumar. If you like, you can put some like and share your comments uh, with this video. Thank you and all the best.